what's going on youtube family this your boy yard coming at you with another video of the american voce relay door fan switch as y'all can see i got everything already wired up my fan wire power wire everything ran right here i'm a Come back in and do something better with that to make it look a little better and tie it up somewhere so it won't flop around. As you can see, I don't install here. This right here is the 12 volt wire to activate it. And the wire that go to the AC compressor and your ground wire. As you can see, that go my power wire, my 12 volt, I use the heat. Oh man, hold on, focus. Focus. Okay, I use the heat strength to eliminate, you know, anything arcing, touching. And then also, oh, sorry about that. Hold on, let me get this back down. I like using this heat strength right here because you see that little clear stuff? It's glue that comes out and it's sealed. So it's water resistant. But yeah, I wanted to make this video to show you that I got it installed. Now, I just got to go get the brass fitting to put back there so it can work like it's supposed to. Believe it or not, hold on, let me show you. As y'all can see, it's working. You really can't see because Okay, there you go. It don't stop where it started back. But yeah, like I was saying, it's a button right here that shows you, I guess, the degrees or whatever you can set. Uh, um, well, I don't know. I got to read up on it some more. But once I learn a little more, I'm going to make a full video of showing you how to set it up, how you get it to work. But right now, since I got the plug, oh, sorry about that, y'all. Hold on, let me zoom out. I got the temperature switch um, plugged in. But if I unplug them, I unplug this. See? I'm automatic. And watch this one. This is going to come on in a second. So, as you can see, it was showing that it was under temperature, that it was cold, I guess, not cold, my bad, my bad, sorry, 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 that I guess it was hot, so when it did, it turns, it turned them on, it is flashing that, so I guess it's saying it's an error somewhere, so what I got to do, Let's go out there and go get like the little adapter. See? It's to shut it right back off. So what I got to do is go to O'Reilly to go get the adapter to plug up into that so I can plug it into the intake. And then it will be done. So what y'all think about this little setup right here? You know, leave in the comment. Tell me if y'all ever dealt with them. If y'all know how to set it up or if you don't rent this on your hot rod or not. Let me know what's going on and tell me what y'all think about it. Remember, man, to like, to comment. You know, I like the feedback. If you ever dealt with this system, American Voce system, let me know. And also, they do have a piece that you can slice right here and put like a piece in now and then run this straight into the holes. I was thinking about ordering that. Um, so what y'all think I should go with? Should I go order this piece and put it in now and run this? to this 
or should I just go get the little brass piece and put it in now and run it straight into the intake? All right, I just wanted to show y'all that I do have it wired up and ready to go. Just need to figure out which way direction do I want to go. Do I want to use the brass piece in the intake or order the piece to go into the radiator hole? So y'all tell me in the comments which way y'all think I should go. This your boy Yard, signing off.